Welcome back, Golly Vibes family. Pray everybody's well. Uh, who knows who Eminem is? Maybe it, maybe all of you, maybe a lot of you, maybe some of you, maybe a few of you. He's a rapper. Uh, he was signed by Dr. Dre. He signed 50 Cent. Been in the game for a, quite a long time. <clears throat> you know, I, I seen some stuff of him. I actually I used to listen to his music a lot, to be honest. Even though it's not music a kid should be listening to. It's not at all. I used to go to sleep with my headphones on. Listening to <clears throat> uh, Slim Shady LP, I think it was. One of them who, that had a crazy song on there called Kim. We was talking about taking a light, taking the life of his baby mother. That's what the song was about. Taking the life of his baby. That's what the song was about. He was taking the life of her. Yeah, crazy. Um, he made. He was on a, at one of the rallies in Michigan. It's like everywhere they go, they just keep putting up, pulling up the biggest celebrity. Like, <laughs> like. It's like, is that what's drawing the crowd or what? Like, you was in Atlanta, you had Usher, you're in Michigan, you got Eminem. I think I think it was Atlanta when they had Megan Thee Stallion, Quavo. Like, my goodness. Anyways, I want to show you guys um, this video of him introducing Barack Obama. And then I'm going to show you the video of Barack Obama rapping the lyrics to Eminem. I mean, it's it's gotten so cringe at this point. It's just like, it, it's blowing my mind to the point where I just have to come over here and show you guys this ridiculousness. Watch this. You lied through your teeth, so that's your feelings is dedicated. Detroit! What up, though? So look, I wrote down a few things I wanted to say. I love you, too. Thank you. I'm here tonight for a couple of important reasons. As most of you know, the city of Detroit and the whole state of Michigan mean a lot to me. And going into this election, the spotlight is on us more than ever, and I think it's important to use your voice. So I'm encouraging everybody to get out and vote, please. I also think that people shouldn't be afraid to express their opinions. And I don't think anyone wants an America where people are worried about retribution or what people will do if you make your opinion known. I think Vice President Harris supports a future for this country where these freedoms and many others will be protected and upheld. And here to tell you much more about that, President Barack Obama. Before we go even any further, I wanna, I wanna I wanna play something one more time. One more time. I also think that people shouldn't be afraid to express their opinions. And I don't think anyone wants an America where people are worried about retribution or what people will do if you make your opinion known. So people should be able to express their opinions, right? About who they want to vote for. Correct? Correct? Maybe somebody should have told Eminem that when he made this. And if you can't decide who you like more in your split on who you should stand beside, I'll do it for you with this. So Eminem just said any fan of his that's not on his side going against Donald, he told them F you. But then he said, People should be able to voice their opinions. Somebody get this man some coffee. He needs to wake up because right now he's double-minded as I don't know what. What is going on? Now let's check out what Barack Obama did when he came out. Now I notice my palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy, vomit on my sweater already. Mom's spaghetti. 
I'm nervous, but on the surface I look calm and ready to drop bombs, but I keep on forgetting. Dun, 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 dun. I thought Eminem was going to be performing. I was going to jump out. Love, love me some Eminem. I love you back. All right. I love you back. It is good to be back in Michigan. Good to be back in Motor City. Now, I heard there was another rally here on Friday night, but it was a little smaller than this one. I, don't boo now, vote. Don't boo. I'm telling you right So Barack now. said he loves him some Eminem. Name another song. <laughs> Name that song. People got good memories. At this point, they, they they're they're reaching in their their pockets trying to find their biggest quarters. I mean, it's it's cringe to see. It's cringe to watch. It truly is. It it, it it's cringe to watch. At this point, I love you more, but I love Kamala Harris even more. I love you more, but I love Kamala Harris even more. What is going on with these celebrities? Modern day slaves. They used to have chains on. Uh, they used to have chains on slaves. Now they buy their own chains. Modern day slaves. Awful what? To, for fame? For money? <sighs> Got to do better, people. Got to do better. Let me know what you guys think of the video. I mean, to me, it's just goofy. It's goofy. It's cringe. It's goofy. It's honestly hilarious. <laughs> it's hilarious. It's laughable. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. God bless you all.